Hey everybody, JP here. It's uh, what's today? Tuesday, shall we? Yeah. About Tuesday, uh, July 13th. I want to say about three in the evening, something like that. Four. Four in the evening. Well, we got a late start. Anyway, we own a house here, and it has two colonies. This is some kind of exterior. What's that? Like a corrugated metal panel or something like that? Yeah, aluminum. Okay, aluminum, huh? Yeah. <clears throat> the interior sheetrock, we're going in through there because it'll be too hard to put this stuff back. Let me see if I can zoom in with this thing on those, shall we? Alright, so let's go ahead and start. I wish we could get that screen up there. I know it's a trick, but I just don't see how old man. Smoker. Watch them bees now. You put your hand on you, you can get stung in them. I have to dig them things out of you again. You don't need no smoke on them bees. You sure? Last time I told you that would happen. You got stung? What we did is we, we pulled the combs out of the wall and, and uh, went across the house on the other end of the house under the carport because it's so warm and uh, we transferred all these combs in, in, in here and these bees are really content to stay right here but what we'll do is when we get everything out we'll go ahead and put the box on the other side of the house you know where, where the hive was and leave it here a day or two and get them all and seal them up like we normally do at night and bring them to the bee yard. Alright this is what we left with folks uh, got this one long little skinny piece of comb. You'd be surprised how often I'll find the queen right behind that little skinny piece. So we got that to pull out. We got some honeycomb up there. And uh, we almost done with this one. We got that other little one in the room that shot we forgot about. <clears throat> and uh, we're going to be pulling them out real soon. Let's go check the box, see if she's in there or not. We'll check the outside and then come back and get that little bit of comb. I'll clean it up. It might drop down or something, who knows. Alright folks, well, this is the second hive that we thought was a little hive, okay? We have comb that on these, it's almost jet black. I, <clears throat> I gotta think these things have been here for more than a couple of years. The comb sections are uh, situated front to back, which I really like. And they're long and continuous, so, and they're wide, so this makes for a, a, a great removal because you can cut the combs and fit them to your frames. Uh, it's about the best you can get so uh, now the other hive we have not got the queen we think she's in a little strip uh, of corrugated aluminum that runs on the outside it's like a little channel and I'm almost certain she's probably in there see they had eggs in here? Uh, oh in there I'm going to see up in that so I would just thought I need to rid of this let me just cut this for a second Put it in. I will put it in there. 
Well, you don't have to go that tall, you know. Well, you say yeah, hold it up tall. Yeah. yeah, I mean, I mean, that's perfect right there. You can see everything. That's good. I heard you say crush. No. You said you crushed it. You said crushed the head it. is buried in the honey. I heard crushed. Well, you crushed the honey, so you buried his head. I didn't it. crush nothing. That's like when I saw that queen first the other day. Yeah, after I saw it. I still say I saw it first, though. Okay. You saw it on that side. I saw it on this side. Yeah, but it's after I saw it. She ran to your you side. Don't know that. <clears throat> I watched her. Well, you might have just said, "Hey, I see the queen." When I was looking right at I it, said, I said, "I said there it is." I didn't see. I didn't need to say that I actually saw the queen. I said there she is. To know, so she to ran know, to, your to know side. what I was looking at. You said, "Look at the queen." To know what I was looking oh, at. Oh, yeah. This queen's laying a pretty good pattern, okay? I'll remove most of this and uh, it'll be Shawi's turn to maybe get the rest of that stuff out. Shall we? Shall we? Shall we? Shall we? Where you at, man? Shall we? Shall we? Hold on. Is that? Where the hell? Oh. That's it. I know I saw him. Where's that shall we? What you doing? Man, it's hot in that house. What, be what you doing out in these weeds, man? It's cooling off. It's cool out here at the end of the house. That ain't right, man. I'm sitting in there sweating my butt off in that house. Yeah, but all you was doing was watching me cut comb. I just told all them people that I cut most of that comb out, which I did. You up. Man, I can't work in that. I see right what now. you're doing. You're working your way over to that pool right there, huh? Yeah, it's going to cool off. Get your butt back in here, shall we? <laughs> We gotta get them bees out. <laughs> this is your hive too. Yeah. Scalp. That's a pretty cool All right, folks, so uh, it's almost 10 o'clock, and Sha, we and I, we, we leaving. We, we, we're heading off. We need All right, folks, back in Avondale, Louisiana, day two, okay? I don't have Sha, we with me today. He's off for uh, fooling with alligators, I guess. This is the, the big hive, okay? As y'all can see, we have a big cluster of bees on the outside, and I'm pretty certain we're going to have our queen in there. This hive over here... The verdict is not out yet. We're going to leave that hive there another day or, and see if, uh, if there is a queen in there. She'll come out. There's a good chance she's in that channel. I see the queen, folks. I'm just going to hold this. Oh, there she is. See her? There's our queen. There you have it, folks. This is day two. Just to recap, this particular house had two colonies. Removed both of them. Yeah, I got all the comb out. I'm shy when I did. We worked on this yesterday evening from about maybe 3 o'clock to uh, about maybe 10 o'clock. Yeah, that's right, folks. About seven hours. And uh, another video brought to you by JP the D Man and Shawi. So, y'all have a good one.